the span of 45 days, I've had three heating and air units stolen and a house full of appliances. Caught in the act, thieves targeting new construction, driving off with tens of thousands of dollars in goods. News 4's Brittany Wider is live in Inglewood, where one builder got hit more than once. And Brittany, these thieves are not working alone. Tom, that's right. Just take a look at this. You can actually see the outline here of where that air and heating unit was sitting. It's a pretty big piece of equipment. And as you can see here, it was just ripped away from this home. The home builder telling me it would likely take three people at least to move a piece of equipment like this. Unfortunately, this and you can tell that they know what they're doing has been a common sight for home builder and former Metro Council member Michael Craddock. In the span of 45 days, I've had three heating and air units stolen. We're approaching the $20,000 mark. One unit was taken just last night. This may be a rogue heat and air guy that's putting these units on somebody else's new house and charging them. Craddock believes it could be the owner of this truck, seen pulling behind his new home builds in September with an empty truck bed and pulling out less than 10 minutes later with a bed full of home appliances. The day that he stole the appliances, he was in and out within six minutes. Had to be three or four of them in the truck. Metro police say because Nashville is a hot construction area, these thefts are common across the city. Typically these situations are industry related subcontractors or somebody in the industry that Craddock hopes this thief is caught. This is grand larceny. They should put him in prison or at the very least quits the crime spree. Hopefully when he sits down to dinner and he watches Channel 4 News or at 10 o'clock he'll see his truck on TV and he'll stop this. There is no suspect description at this time, just a description of the truck. Take a look at your screen. It appears to be a gray Ford F-150 diesel with black trim and a black br bu uh, bush guard, I should say, on the front of that truck. Now, police recommending to builders tonight that you log all the serial numbers of big appliances or equipment in these homes. And also, if you can, put alarms on any of these big equipment items or even on the new homes that will help deter these criminals. Tom. Brittany, thanks. What a shame you have to actually do that.